Have you ever wondered who was the first Hispanic woman to travel into space? That honor belongs to the remarkable Ellen Ochoa. Born on May 10, 1958, in the heart of Los Angeles, Ellen's fascination with science and technology was evident early in her life. This passion guided her through her educational journey, eventually earning her not one, not two, but three degrees in electrical engineering. Her path wasn't without its obstacles, though. After applying to NASA in 1985, she was met with rejection. But Ellen, with her tenacity and resolve, didn't let this setback dampen her spirits. Instead, she persevered, fueled by her relentless desire to contribute to the field of space exploration. Now, armed with a PhD in electrical engineering, she was determined to make her mark. But what does it take to be the first Hispanic woman in space? Let's delve into the journey of Ellen Ochoa, the trailblazer who dared to dream and reach for the stars. In 1990, Ochoa was selected by NASA to participate in its prestigious astronaut program. She completed her rigorous training by the following year, ready to take on the challenges of space exploration. As a mission specialist, Ochoa was integral to several space shuttle missions. Her expertise was invaluable in conducting intricate experiments and assisting in the construction of the awe-inspiring International Space Station. Her dedication to her role was evident in her total time spent in space, amounting to nearly 1,000 hours. Throughout her career, she embarked on four unforgettable space missions, each contributing to our understanding of the cosmos and our place within it. From engineer to astronaut, Ellen Ochoa made history in the vast expanse of space. But did you know that her contributions didn't stop at space exploration? Ellen Ochoa's journey continued back on Earth, with her becoming the director of NASA's Johnson Space Center in 2013. Not only was she the first woman to hold this position, but she was also the first Hispanic. Her leadership extended beyond her astronaut days as she guided the direction of human space exploration for five years. In 2018, Ochoa retired from NASA, but she didn't stop there. She shifted her focus to the National Science Board, serving first as vice chair and then ascending to the role of chair in 2020. Her dedication to scientific research and exploration remained steadfast. Throughout her career, Ochoa has been recognized with numerous awards, a testament to her significant contributions to space exploration. She's not just a space traveler, but also a trailblazer, breaking barriers and setting new standards in the field of science and technology. From space to the boardroom, Ellen Ochoa continues to inspire and lead. So, what can we learn from Ellen Ochoa's remarkable journey? From humble beginnings, she ascended as the first Hispanic woman in space. Her relentless pursuit of knowledge, seen in her engineering feats, led her to stellar heights. Even in retirement, she continued to wield influence, inspiring future generations. Remember, in the words of Ellen Ochoa, don't be afraid to reach for the stars. And before we go, don't forget to subscribe to our Facts Fed channel for more informative and engaging content.